Okay. That's Conklin in motion. And it's a handoff. Hall to the 40. So look at that game in preparation for this one. On first down, Brees Hall shakes a couple of tackles. Brees Hall has a first down. Second and five. Hall again ahead of steam. Nice tackle from behind by Patrick Queen. It's Hall. And the tackle made by Calais Campbell. And Stevens is very unheralded in that secondary as well. Here's Hall. And Clark makes the tackle. And I think you just get anxious to get back in if you're Zach Wilson. I don't know if there's a whole lot you can learn just by watching all the time. Brees Hall down the sideline, and he picks up the first down. Oway makes the tackle. And one other injury note for the Jets today, no C.J. Uzama, one of their free agent acquisitions, out today after he tweaked the hamstring in practice this week. Here is Brees Hall trying to find the edge. Hall, third and two. Jets on the ground. This is Hall, first down and more. Hall breaking free. Inside the five, we'll see where the officials mark the football. John Johnson finally on a stop for Cleveland. What a run. Saw that big free agent contract before last season after his first four years in Nashville. Pitch play, Hall. Can't complete a ball inbounds. You don't have enough time to run the field goal. Team on has to go to the end zone or throw it away. Well, does Flacco go here? Near side of the field, wide open is Hall. Touchdown. And the Jets strike back on the verge of tying this game. Just line them up right here in the backfield. Nothing simple. Just going to come out into the flat. Confusion in the Browns secondary. Nobody takes him coming out. It's wide open, easy completion for Flacco. And a very good drive for the New York Jets to come and tie this game before halftime. All right, coach, what an early season matchup there. Here's Hall trying to break that tackle. Wrapped up beautifully right at the 20-yard line. Marks him back five yards just inside the 40. First and 15 pitch. Hall. Able to wiggle his way through, get some of that penalty yardage back. Chase Winovich. Runs him out of bounds. <laughs> not, not the disagreement. That happens. But the penalty. Dump off. Turns into a big gain for Hall. First down. The fiery nature of Anarumo. On a give. Hall tried those long strides. And he's brought down at the 23. A gain of four and a half. Flacco. Step and fire. Hall zigzags his way to the 24, and that's going to take us to the two-minute warning. Hall shifts out of the backfield. Flacco hits his man. It's Hall for a first down. And, and you know, he went through the quad two seasons ago. He knows what a bad injury feels like. Flacco gets rid of it with a low pass handled by Hall. Third down and two. One timeout remaining for the Jets. Flacco to Hall, spin move, Hall trying to get to the sideline, could not. It is enough for a first down, but they have to call the timeout. Mike Hilton makes the tackle. And finding Conklin open in the flat. Head off to Hall. Legs churning to midfield. And as a coach, you can set foot there with where a rival is. Doesn't ah. work. Hall, the carry. And a new set of downs for the Jets to work with. Gain of three. Evan will give us a little bit more. And he even went to the Giants locker room today, guys. I mean, he's that connected at times to that organization. Interviewed for the job in the offseason. And a former assistant coach with the Giants. And in Miami, now in his fourth year with the Cincinnati Bengals. They wanted to keep the ball in front, make you check it down, and rally up and tackle. Good break in there. And it's Hall for a first down across the 30-yard line. Here's a third and five. Going to give it to Brees Hall. Hall. Little short pop complete. And to the 20-yard line goes Hall. 
And that's about four yards short of a first down. It's on first down, and a big part of that is the offensive line not getting beat on those matchups up front. On second and eight, this is Hall, and Hall with running room inside the 10 and out of bounds just inside the five-yard line. New right tackle on the field for the Jets. That's Connor McDermott. This is Brees Hall, and Brees Hall breaking through. Good job by Wilson staying with the play and making a key throw. On the ground with Brees Hall, and Hall to about the 47-yard line. 22-yard pickup. The give is to Brees Hall. Hall gets a block inside the 10, inside the 5, looking for the end zone. Did he get there? He is marked out of bounds at about the three-yard line. Wilson pulls it down, now throws over the middle, and that is complete to about the 46-yard line. Brees Hall. Making a play in, in big moments. That has been there all game. First and goal. They'll give it to Hall. Hall to the five. Hall bulls his way to about the two-yard line. They'll give it to Hall. Looking for the end zone, and he... Did he get there? He lost the football. Looks like Tyler Conklin may have recovered the ball. First and ten. Uzama the tight end on the move with a couple backs and a fake by Wilson. And a block by Uzama. And downfield they go. This is the rookie running back Hall. There's a block downfield by Berrios. Still on his feet. Dragging defenders down to the one. He just gets lost in coverage. The Dolphins lose him coming out of the backfield, and Wilson puts it right on him. And then the last 15, 20 yards is all Brees Hall trying to get in the end zone. Second down and three. It's Hall. Got a block there from Tomlinson. And that uncorks him. Second and two. Hall, the hesitation. And, he's, and he still would have gotten paid. That, that says a lot about Dwayne Brown. He's 37. He's, he's had over 200 starts in his career. He's like, listen, I want to play football. Chris Hall into the secondary. That's a loss of 17, making it third and 25. They need the 34. Chris Hall, blockers ahead, including Tomlinson and Connor McGovern in the center. And he plows his way out near the 25. Second down, nine. To the two-time All-America, Chris Hall. Got it. Down near the one. 21 yard catch and run. But now the Jets with an opportunity to try and stretch this lead. Brees Hall. That's a block by Uzama. Flag thrown. Burrowing to the one. Two flags thrown. Gain of four. As it stands now. Elbow wasn't down. The knee wasn't down. The ball breaks the plane. It is a touchdown. They call the face mask right there. Sure, he was on his own player. Zach Wilson, 14 to 21. Hand off here. Big hole. Breeze Hall. He's got the first down. A trap play inside. And a beauty. Hall running free. Breeze Hall inside the 10. He's going to score. Touchdown, Jets. Watch this design. They've run it again. It's a trap. They're going to fake the toss. Trap to Brees Hall. Watch. They're going to kick out, kick out, bang, and just hit it downhill. And then the rest is just Brees Hall. We've talked about him all day. He's dynamic. Yeah, they got a block punt for a touchdown today. That has helped. Here's Brees Hall up the middle. Nice hole. Hall with a stiff arm. Hall with a first down and up to midfield for Brees Hall, the rookie. Brees Hall's over 100 yards rushing, 106 to be exact. Here's another one. Going to add to it with another big run inside the 44 Hall. We're watching two teams seemingly headed in opposite directions, but a win for Denver, they feel like they're right back in this thing. Second snap for Denzel Mims. He's in there. They go to the run game. Oh, look at the speed of Brees Hall. He's done it again. Brees Lightning, 62 yards for the touchdown. And look at how they move. You remember earlier I talked about those big dancing bears up front offensive line? Well, it wasn't just them. Because downfield, number 11, Denzel Mims activated for this game, filling in with Elijah Moore being left at home.